think people don't realize that Florida is home to the world's most powerful magnets. Some three decades ago, Florida State University outdueled MIT as a host site for a most prestigious research facility that in some ways touches each and every one of us. The National High Magnetic Field Laboratory, or MAGLAB as it's called, is funded by the National Science Foundation and the state of Florida, a facility that is truly one of a kind. The MAGLAB is the largest and highest powered magnet lab in the world. This is like the center of the universe for high magnetic field research. And essentially we exist to design and build the most powerful magnets in the world and then share them with scientists who come from all over the globe to conduct research using the power of high magnetic fields. We actually opened for science back in 1994, and we've been hosting about 1,500, 2,000 scientists who come to conduct their own research every year. I think people don't realize that Florida is home to the world's most powerful magnets, that we are home to this national asset for high field research, and you know that we are a destination for researchers from literally around the world who travel here to, to conduct their experiments. Magnets are used in a wide variety of research, from technology to science to medicine and even the environment. High magnetic fields turn out to be these exceptionally interdisciplinary research tools. If you've been to a doctor's office or a hospital and you've had an MRI, you've actually been in the center of a powerful magnet yourself. And they tell us all sorts of really important things that help us create the technology of the future, build ways to treat diseases, energy solutions, and you know protect our planet. We measure the strength of a magnet in a unit called Tesla. It's not just a car. It's the strength of magnetic fields. And it's actually named after Nikola Tesla, a famous pioneer in electricity and magnetism research. So when we think about magnets, you know, a lot of us picture the things on our refrigerators. And that fridge magnet at your house, it's probably 0.02 Tesla, something like that. If you've ever seen a junkyard magnet that could pick up a whole car, that's about one Tesla. And here at the MagLab in Tallahassee at our headquarters facility at Florida State University, we have magnets that reach 45 Tesla, exceptionally powerful. You know, people are bringing samples of materials to put in powerful magnets, and they're learning about the electronic behavior of those materials. And so the discoveries that are being made in these magnets are literally building the technology of the future.